My name's Akira. I'm the top dog at this high school. I'm so tough that even if a bunch of guys from other schools got together, they wouldn't be able to touch me. That's me, but I'm currently facing the biggest crisis of my life so far. You. What the hell did you just say? Uh, I said, please make me your student. Seems like I didn't mishear that. My student? Are you some kind of idiot that only looks smart? What do you want to be my student for? Uh, I want... I want to be a delinquent! <laughs> this girl with the tacky glasses is our class president, Shizuka. A total outcast. Super serious student who transferred in halfway into the first year at a school with people like me. Listen, you've got entrance exams next year, right? Someone headed to college like you becoming a delinquent. Are you stupid? D don't you have entrance exams next year too? No, not gonna bother. But, but I just want to be a baddie. All right, I get it, I get it. It's that, right? You had to transfer schools in the middle of the year, but the only school accepting transfers at that time was our school. So you tried your best to study. But your parents wouldn't stop nagging you. So you got mad and wanted to do bad things, right? How do you know all that? I was right. And besides, you're so scared and you still want to be my student? Haven't you been shaking nonstop? Well, well, if I was going to learn, I thought I would learn from the best. So diligent. Huh? If you're going to be a delinquent, get rid of the glasses. They're dangerous and in the way. And get rid of those stupid pigtails. People are going to look down on you. Uh... Can I really become a delinquent like this? <sighs> uh, you, you Put your glasses back on for a second! Uh, uh, okay. So, it's not good? I... I mean... It was okay. Do you really mean that? I look more like a delinquent without glasses, right? This girl... She's too cute without her glasses on! And when you think of delinquents, it has to be blonde hair, right? Huh? Don't do it! What a waste! Huh? Uh... What, uh, what we, what we should do as delinquents is to make use of our original colors. Eh? Our original colors? Th that's what it means to be a delinquent to me. Your dark hair looks so beautiful against your fair skin. I, I see. So next we should talk about skirt length, right? <laughs> <laughs> You idiot! Delinquents gotta have super long skirts! Akira-san, are you okay? But... but that's what they used to wear a long time ago. Shut up! If you want to be my student, your skirt needs to be below your knees! <gasps> so that means you will take me on as your student! It can't be helped. Uh, brother, I will take care of your wounds right away! And your nose. R right. From the wall. Y yeah And don't call me brother. Akira is fine. Is that... But I'm your student, you know? Is that okay? I'm the type that prefers to have an equal relationship between teacher and student. It's not even a student-teacher relationship anymore. Uh, okay then. Akira? Cute. It's a little embarrassing without honorifics. Is Akira-kun no good? You want to be bad, right? Only goody-two-shoes use honorifics. Th that's true. I understand. Then, Akira, allow me to escort you to your home. Escort? I will handle your luggage. No, thank you. Uh, my bag! I'm the type that prefers to carry his student stuff. As... As expected. Huh? 
I had thought the delinquents had underlings to show off their own strength, and that they would torment them as well. But the best delinquents are different! Building an equal relationship with their subordinates and making sure to care for them! The ideal boss! A mirror image of a growing company! That doesn't have anything to do with delinquents anymore. That kind of delinquent has a girlfriend? What does he plan to do with such a serious-looking girl? W well it must look like she's my girlfriend to other people. So, where's your house? It's near the post office. That's the opposite direction! I will escort you home first! Idiot! It'll be dark on the way back! But... but... Come on, we're going. If you're my underling, you need to take care of yourself first. Okay... <gasps> I grabbed your hand in the middle of it! Hey, hey, Makira. Huh? That's an awfully cute girl you got with you. She your woman? That's not... That's right! I'm Akira's woman! <gasps> Wait, do you know what that means? Eh? Doesn't it mean that I'm your female underling? Wait, 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 wait. You might be my senior in delinquency, but I won't let you lay a hand on Akira! Aren't you energetic, cutie? Come play with me instead. I'll teach you all sorts of fun things. I'm still in the middle of my apprenticeship, so I can't do that! <sighs> you put so much as a finger on her, I'll show you what hell looks like! I... I forgot I had some urgent business. Later! Are you okay? That was scary, but I tried my best. <laughs> How about you give up on being a delinquent? Huh? I refuse! I want to be the strongest delinquent, just like Akira! You know to be the strongest, you'd have to beat me first, right? Of course! Someday I will definitely surpass you! <sighs> what should I do? How do I tell her? Huh? Your face is kind of red, you know. That's just from the sunset, idiot. How do I tell her that I've already lost? <sighs> 